like damn who give me some food for thought changing the pasta you had in your heart hey what's going on what's going on it's your boy tyrell clemens i'm coming to you with my beautiful wife miss wendy it is time for us to give you your breakfast for your soul your food for thought so wendy what do you have for him on this morning well today's quote comes from mr robert collier uh -huh, what he talking it's about success is the sum of small efforts mm -hmm. repeated day in and day out Ooh, say that thing one more time success is what success is the sum of small efforts repeated day in and day out Listen, ladies and gentlemen, let me un help you to understand something right now. What? Success is not an overnight thing. You can't have instant. I mean, so many people think that it's like some instant grits or something. It's not instant, y'all. So many folks think you just, boom, I'm successful overnight. It just happened. Boom. Oh, my God. This guy became successful overnight. But what you don't see, you know, these people who, uh, who become successful overnight, you don't see the years that they put in, the, the struggle that they put in. Kevin Hart is an instant success. He was successful overnight. Kevin Hart had a lot of flops before he became the infamous Kevin Hart. Y'all seen Soul Plane. It took a long time before he became successful. And what I want you to understand, success is not overnight. It takes a lot of effort. It takes a lot of consistency. You have to keep pushing this thing day in and day out. Let me talk about my mama real quick. I love her. Mama, you watch it. I love you, though. I'm still, I'm still going to talk about you. you. I'm, I'm still going to talk about you. Like my mama, when she started diet plan, the very first day, she was like, ooh, baby, look, I, I'm losing weight. Look at my pants. My pants fit looser. You just you just pulling them. You just, it's elastic. They're going to just stop pulling your pants. You're not losing weight on the first day. But so many people think they're going to get their weight loss goal on one day or they're going to get their strength goal on one day. That's not how success is achieved. It takes Day in, day out, day in, day out, small effort, small things, day in and day out. Success is a step. You've got to go up yep, these steps, stairs. these stairs. There's levels. One step, two steps, three steps. You just keep going. You're not jumping from here to there. You just got to keep making those steps. Keep making those steps. Well, it's like when you want to run a mile. You don't instantly run from here to a mile. It's you take one step. You take one step. You just keep moving. That's how success is achieved. You just keep moving. You don't go to the gym and boom, you just strong as all know it first day. Boom, it's just there. No, it don't work that way. You keep pushing every day. It's kind of like every day. Tierra when mm -hmm. she started her little workout. Thing. Right. That she started off when she was walking on three. Uh huh. And then she went up to maybe she's doing three five. And then maybe three six. Then maybe four. And now she's up here running on five, I think five eight the other day. Five eight. I had to run five eight. But it's, and the thing is, it's all about making those consistent steps. Let me tell you something. Like, I don't know if y'all ever had a, a pot, uh, not a pot, but a water faucet that just drips. That, it's aggravating. It's on up. It's drip. Drip. Drop. Drip. 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 Every, overnight. Drip. And you, you don't really pay much attention to it because you just hear drip. 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 But when you wake up in the morning, you look at that that pot. You look at how much water it is a it's a whole pot, and that's how success is, man. It, it, you just keep making one step, and one step, and one. Step. And before you know it, you got a whole bowl full of success. I, I'm, I'm gonna tell you a quick story, man, because like one day in my office years ago, one of my offices, uh, the toilet was running. Right? Mm -hmm. I, I didn't I didn't think nothing about it. Cause it ain't like it's crazy. It's just it's just you just hear that noise. I mean, it just didn't it, stop. And then uh, I got my, my bill from from, from, bills, from River Jesus. Utilities, and my, my bill is a thousand something dollars. I'm like, Hold up! I mean, what in the world? You you don't recognize it because it's just a small old thing, consistently, consistently, consistently. But consistency makes big impact in time. I I I, I always talk about starting these. Retirement plans when you're 20, when you're 25, when you're young. Anybody don't think it's nothing. You're saving twenty dollars a, a month, twenty dollars a week when you're when you're younger. You don't think about it, but when you turn 50, that twenty dollars will be worth two thousand dollars because of consistently doing something. It, it, it's just like me and Wendy. She always gets on me because I don't pay no attention. I'm like, it ain't but five dollars. Don't worry about it. It ain't but seven dollars. Don't worry about it on Monday. It ain't but five dollars. It's just look. It's just five dollars. But what y'all don't realize is that five dollars. That five dollars on Monday, that that's seven dollars on Tuesday, that's twelve. That another five dollars on Wednesday, that's what uh, seventeen. Then another, another ten dollars on. That's on, twenty-seven. So that's twenty-seven. That's tank of gas. You got a whole tank of gas that you just wasted. You thinking, man, I'm just gonna keep eating out. You pay twenty dollars a person to eat out, right? Twenty dollars to eat out on Monday. Twenty dollars eat out on Tuesday. You done spent over a hundred dollars a week from eating out when you, you could have cooked. 
And, and, and so many folks don't realize how these small things build up in, in good ways and bad ways. I think that's one lesson that I think when we give kids piggy banks as uh -huh. a kid, is like you're teaching them, you put this one penny in, you put this next penny in. After a while, all those pennies are going to add up. I remember when I had change back in the day, I, when I finally went and got it exchanged, I had over $100. And I was really little. So to me, that was a lot. Of money. That was a lot, man. Hey, let me tell you, I actually had a sock. You know, I won't, it's used to did he have piggy banks. I, am, I had a sock. I, I mean, don't judge me, y'all, but like sometimes, like yes. what happened with in church, I mean, it was a fresh style, a church sock too, cause it stretched. And so went in church sometimes, like I used to, I used to kind of, mama, don't, don't, don't judge me. I used to, it's like somebody dropped some change and stuff, like little quarters in the, in the crack to the seat in the pew. I was like, that's, I, that's the Lord works in mysterious ways. So I mean, I put I that, I put that in my, in my pocket and stuff, and I put it in my sock. I went to Foot Locker one day with my sock and bought me a pair of Jordans. Uh, I'm not, I mean, mad. hey, but the thing is, <laughs> hey, 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 I bought them. But what you don't understand though is those small deposits that 25 cent, that 15, 15, 30 cent, the 20, 80, 80, whatever. I had all these little change, whatever pocket I had, threw it in that sock. It added up into a pair of Jordans. And the same thing happens with success in life. And you just keep working. All right, I did this this day, I did this this day. It adds up. I want you to be successful. I want you to have it, but I don't want you to have the mindset that it's going to happen overnight. It takes consistency. You have to keep pushing consistently. You have to keep striving consistently. If you can do that, I guarantee you, you will be successful. If you can wake up every single morning, look at yourself in the mirror and say, let's, let's go, go to work. work. You will be successful. We want you to have it. So make sure in 2020, you go get it. And make sure you subscribe so you can consistently watch us every morning. You better <laughs> preach. That is your breakfast for your soul. Yes, you are food yes. for thought. Bye. It's the Clemens. It's the Clemens. We the Clemens. We the Clemens.